it's not really hard to display this we're going to just check whether this exists if this exists then we display if not it we won't and of course we'll close these extra spaces so we'll go to our code and in the add dot tweak at the top of the form we'll make sure that these extra spaces are not there just remove the extra spaces and then we'll put it inside an if statement so we will just say if um this is how you do if statements in tweak we say if this guy is there which is just pasted there if it is there then display if not we will just do an end and if so this hot out our problem if we go to this place and we refresh reload of course if we just visit this page directly okay cool as you can see there is no such results here so this basically solves a problem of search results okay then we are going to just um, delete this search results so this is not necessary and uh, in fact the whole header is not necessary delete this header that's also a basic problem all right and um apart from the first name we can display other things like this last name of this user and um, a little more information about where they stay their location you can say last name so we can location can be something like um, user dot skills dot states user dot state dot name and then what else do we need to pass in uh, about this user whatever other details we will need to pass in all right this solves our problem we have user we have skills then of course we'll do the same thing for skills then we reverse engineer and go back our skills have id and description so we will go to this place and it searches controller exactly what we're trying to do so i think um we can do this or where again several times just to cover for all the other conditions in the users table we can say or where it is the same thing as the email and say email search them so as a guide we can use our users table quickly login our users table has local government has countries has first name last name email and i don't think we have any other thing so these are basically gender okay these are basically what people um, will search for so we can just say gender to okay cool and just say or where the order doesn't really matter copy paste cool so we can say gender so that our clients can just come in and just search for male and get all the guys or female and get all the women all right now we've done this we can just do the same thing with with skills so the skill of course we can make sure that we imported skill good then the skill is basically the same thing where we'll do where and um, where the skill name is equal to the search term okay but this time around it appears we won't use equal to we'll use uh, we we'll use like because somebody might be uh, the skill name might be php and somebody is searching for php development you understand so we we'll just use something that has to do with like so to do that we'll do a little trick where we'll put a percentage the percentage basically tells uh, tells your mysql that you're looking for anything that looks like okay so we're saying we are the name remotely matches this and then we're, we'll do another or where or where the same thing does for the description okay so we will um work with the description too and do exactly the same thing skill we'll just do it for the description then at the end of everything you want to get so you want to do an 
get. Okay, so we've sorted for scales. What else do we look for? We look for states. Same thing. So somebody can just type their states and see everybody within that state, okay? And then uh, we'll do a get at the end of it. Then we can just do that one is simple. We can just do state name is the same thing as the search term. Cool. So this sorts our problem. The other thing, the other last thing we can do is the country. So we can see all Nigerians there. Country name is the same thing as the search term. So we'll call it country. So this sorts our problem. Um, okay. <clears throat> so from here, what we're going to do is let's comment this out first. The issue of the state. We'll come back and in another video and fix this because we're supposed to find all users in the state that, it, that is matched and all users in the country that is matched. Okay, so it's a different um, query that we'll do for that. So let's quickly pass in skills and, um, and the search term. So here we can just add skills to the result. It says skills and then we do this and then we separate with the comma. Okay, so skills is now available in the Add so we can just for the copy what we have here we'll copy go to the skills page this is the place we'll replace it and change skill as skills and then here we can do skill.name skill.name The rest is not important. So what else we can do is to quickly add a, make it a URL. Okay. If we make it a URL, it will work. So to make it a URL, we have to, we have to add href and enclose it into this. Why am I typing skill? Okay, so we will now do our usual um, path for path for. We will say that this goes to skills dot index because we know how our skill is already um, built to function. So inside the index, we are passing an ID with the value of skill dot ID. All right. So when they click on it, it will open the list of skills. It will open the skill and then the list of people that are in that skill. I think it should be in the skill view also. So when we view the skill, we'll see everybody that has that skill. All right, the same thing with states and stuff. So um, this basically pretty much solves our problem. And then um, here we're going to do the same kind of manipulation we did to create, make it a URL. So the person's name becomes a URL. We we'll just add it here, and of course, close it with a href. All right. So what we have here is basically this, and we'll call it user users view user ID. So you can just click on the name, and then to take you to the user the users page. So if we come here and uh, search again for John. I'm searching for John because we know that at least we have a John. I can just search for Do Admin. Do Admin. And hit Enter. As you can see, we have John Do Admin in Lego State. And if we go to Skills, um, there is no skill that matches your John Do Admin. So we just have John Do Admin in Lego State. All right, so this basically um, sorts our problem. And if we click on it, takes us to John Doe's profile. Very good, and the person can contact John Doe from here. So we've, we've started our search. Our search now works. So in subsequent videos, we'll go move on to subsequent things. Thank you.